Welcome back everybody to the Reef and Rican channel. We have water in the tank. So, I got the plumbing done on the anemone tank. So I'm filling it up with water and checking for leaks. And so far, so good. Here's where I'm gonna put the Apex Classic. It was easy plumbing to do. So it's halfway full. Sorry for all the movement, it's hard to hold the hose and film at the same time. I did the plumbing in the back. I'll show that in a little bit. Let's get this filled and see how it does. All right, it's full. No leaks, I just had a little, well, I had a little leak underneath. I just had to tighten up the, the bulkhead. But other than that, everything's good. Here's the overflow. I drill a little hole in the top. Makes it silent. Nice and easy. Come around, give you a full look. Here's the sump. Like I said, simple plumbing. There's two pipes coming down. I put some unions, just in case I gotta take it apart. I don't have to take it apart to move it to its final destination. There's my Apex Classic where I'm gonna put it. This would be my refugium and skimmer section. That pipe's not glued so I could um, adjust it in case I want to put a filter sock in there. Then it overflows into this chamber. I just threw that in there just to catch some debris that's floating around. I was going to put the skimmer on this section here, but it doesn't fit. And that's the fill line. Then it goes through the bubble trap. To the back, to the return section. And that's the j bow that came with the tank. And it shoots straight back up into the tank. So it's pretty simple. Like I said, that was those two back pieces where the last 90 is. It's not connected. So I could rotate it, take it off, put it back on. Add a filter socket if I want to. Again, the apex goes there and the rest of the controllers are going that back wall. Let's see, and here's the return line coming out. I still gotta add attachments to it. It's pretty quiet. No leaks, I'm happy. So now I'm uh I'm gonna shut it off and see how much water fills into the sump area. I did order a check valve, but I ordered the wrong size, so. But if it doesn't overflow too bad, I might not just put it on, just leave it the way it is. Let's take a quick look. And Happy New Year's, everybody. Hope everybody had a safe and Wonderful New Year. Let's get a close-up down here. It only fills up about an inch over the fill line once it's off, which isn't too bad. So, I'm turn it back on. Let it run for a little while. Make sure everything's okay. So, there it goes. Kick back on. Remember to subscribe. Tap the bell for notifications. And I'll catch you guys next time on the Reef from Rican channel. Thanks for watching.